like a rich business owner, a rich investor of some kind, uh, and you vote for Rick Perry, you're literally a fucking idiot because you're voting directly against your own interests by his own fucking admission. Because when it was pointed out to him that the tax plan that he uh, un unveiled, I guess, that would be the right word, uh, unveiled, released onto society and shared. This is the tax policy that he's going to enact. When it was pointed out to them, to him, the incredible regressiveness of his tax and how the tax burden would be shifted from those who have wealth, aka the ability, who have more of an ability to pay taxes, and it would shift that tax burden to those who don't have wealth, aka have a lower ability to pay taxes. Because that, that makes a lot of fucking logical sense. But, um... So, when it was pointed out to him that this is the case, that his tax system would be incredibly regressive, his response was, I don't care about that. That, 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 that. That's what he said, you know? It's like, if I was like here, and I was like, hey, how do you feel about the aggressiveness of your thing? It's like, well, I don't care about that. And it's just like, that's it. That was his response. It was like, if it comes to that way, then let it come. It's essentially what he was saying. Uh, I'll include an article to the direct thing he said down in the underbar. But he did say, I don't care about that. Uh, he, doesn't, he doesn't care about the fact that he would be widening the income gaps, widening the wealth gaps, and shifting the tax burden from those who have the ability to pay to those who don't have the ability to pay. And, and, and so if you're not part of that, that one class of people that's actually benefiting from what he would call his tax system, if you're not actually part of that, then then what the fuck are you voting for him for? Because because if you are a conservative, it's you you, you, li you likely believe in less and lower taxes. You want there to be fewer taxes around. You want to be taxed at a lower rate than you currently are. Yet if you were to vote for Rick Perry, or on a slightly related note, Herman Cain, because his plans are regressive as well. Yay! Actually, I take that back. Most of the conservative economic ideas are aggressive. Woo! So you're voting against your own interests no matter who you vote for. Congratulations. Now, don't take that as fucking fact because I don't know every single conservative economic plan in the mainstream at the moment. I'm not, you know, that much of a fucking wizard or guru on this shit. Not that I am in any sense of the words. But back to Rick Perry. So... He specifically said he doesn't give a shit about you if you happen to be poor or middle class. If you're not a rich business owner, Rick Perry's tax policy and his tax system doesn't give a shit about you. So if you are a conservative and you want fewer taxes in your life, why vote for him when he has responded to the fact that it's just like, hey, taxes are going to increase for most people underneath your plan. And he's just like, well, I don't care. It, it wasn't even like Herman Cain did when Herman Cain was like, no, apples and oranges, you know, you're comparing different things, or that's not the way it is, or that's a lie, you know? Herman Cain is much more fierce about it. Rick Perry was just like, I don't care. He doesn't give a shit about you. He doesn't give a shit about your economic freedom. He doesn't give a shit about any of the things that he's told you he stands for. He only gives a shit about himself and his rich fucking donors. Pretty much himself. So, I said at the beginning of the video, and I'll say it again, you're a fucking idiot if you vote for Rick Perry. Unless you're a rich businessman. At which point, you're just an idiot, because then you're voting again, you're voting for a plan that's counteractive to everyone else. 99% of the people, when it benefits you. Which, of course, is incredibly selfish, stupid, and I will punch you in the face for doing such things. That was a joke. I'm not actually going to punch anybody in the face. Please don't sue me.